Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft Edge, as we have been talking about, and as you may well know, if you do use Edge, has a feature that if we head to our system and performance, under the performance section, has a feature called enable resource controls, controls how much RAM memory your browser can use. And under the section, you've got a slider that you can adjust to select a RAM usage level, according to Microsoft, that the browser can use. So as an example, if I set it to five gigs out of the eight I have on the system, it can't use more than the allocated amount you select with this slider under those resource controls. And you've got two options where this can be applied, while PC gaming, which is default, or always, which controls RAM memory use at all times. Now, I'm currently showing you this slider in the Canary version, which is an early preview version, because if we head over to the stable version, and we head to the exact same feature in the stable version under performance, you can see something is not right. It's got zero gigabytes, zero gigabytes. So it's not allocating the amount of RAM that is enabled on my system or is installed on my system. And I'm not able to slide or drag this slider. So clearly a bug. Now I did see a comment in regards to this yesterday. And I have noticed this for a good couple of days now. So, so I thought it did warrant a video just to get you all on the same page. If you're wondering what this is, or if maybe you thought you were the only one affected. So if you are seeing this, you are not alone. Now I have tried a couple of things. I've, I've turned off enable resource controls, re-enabled it, nothing. I've restarted the browser, changed different settings, nothing. So it's clearly a bug. And just wanted to put it out there in case you were unaware or, as mentioned, you thought you were the only one experiencing this. And obviously, if I get knowledge that this is addressed and gets fixed, I'll let you guys know. And even if we turn off some of these settings, nothing changes. So I have fiddled around a bit and not able to get this to work as it should, as mentioned, like it is over in the Canary browser. And when that gets adjusted and fixed, obviously, I'll try and post and keep you in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.